All right, let's find ourselves some sea creatures today. Get some nice beasts of the sea. All right, got a nice 21 minutes, day 76. Flowers are growing nicely, got everything we need here. Yep, 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 everything and more. Uh, let's see, just in case, I want the, want the stag breaker, I know, it's like, it's a lot. Also, my mount sensitivity has returned, the normal, so let's drag that back down. Yeah, that's much better. Uh, okay, oh, my mouse sensitivity is still really high? Maybe it's like returned, return to normal. I can just drop that. That's still pretty high. Was it just my mouse pad the whole time? That's that's good. I think it was just my mouse pad and my mouse positioning. Maybe that isn't that good. No, this is pretty great. Sorry for taking everything around, but I gotta get that sorted out. This is good. These are looking good. I can fit more of these up. I'm gonna do that. Grab six of these and I should have 24 fine wood. Let's go grab the axe. Chop down some more trees. Let's see. I don't know why I had my... I had my phone in the way of my arm. A bit uncomfortable. Yeah, I'm bringing the sag breaker back just because... Uh, I don't know when... Whoa. I know I won't be dragging a serpent to the swamp. So to say. So I'm just kind of in a weird situation. Where's that? There we go. I have the axe equipped. I'm in a weird situation where when I land, there's like all these gray dwarfs and things, and I might want to use stag breaker. And I don't want to be like in the swamp. So probably not going to be using the sword. So I'll put the sword away, put the axe away. That's a perfect amount of fine wood that I needed. These sorts of uh, decisions that we make regarding bringing things where is exactly what Iron Gate wants you to do. They want you to make these choices. And I'm glad that I have enough uh, tools now and weapons where I can make these choices because I like making those choices. That's uh That's that feels good to me. Alright, let's get these up. Alright. Okay, so I need Skeleton first. This here for now. Skeleton. Frogger, Grey Dwarf, like so. It's looking good. Things are coming together. Put this back here put this wood away there and everything looks good here okay 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 fully rested we got everything set up nice about our three staminas just in case let's head to ooh, ooh. I think I want to head to planes first because I think my 
barley is probably ready and I want to make more barley wine. Where is... it's right here. Okay. So when the inevitable guide is over, because we're we're, we're reaching into the, the end of this early game guide. The end of the series is really close. Uh, I think I'll continue partially. And I'll do uh, a series called like Earl's Good Gatherings or Earl's Gorgeous Gatherings. Uh, call it Egg. Because I think that's pretty funny. And it'll just be my uh, journeys just kind of on this character, on this world, there's a fulling right there. And uh, I'll be gathering up a bunch of decorations and you'll see me uh, doing a variety of decorations. Which is super interesting. At least I think so. I hope you find it interesting. Ooh. Right, I still have to hoe up that uh, tar sometime. What's my jump? How am I able to jump over that? 45, almost 46? I like that. Oh! Since when we're running jump right next to each other? Was that a new change? Huh. I like it. Whatever it is, I, I appreciate that. 56 barley? the planting and fit one more there uh, I've got 38 now let's plant until I have 20 left oh that one's dying sorry needs more room to grow oh well I have way more barley than I need right now so it's okay There's 8, so we're down to 30. Uh, 30. See, that should be 20. Ooh, nope, I miscounted. Okay, that should be fine. So, I should have way more than I need. I will kill any nearby Skeetos. Please, Skeeto Trophy, that would be cool. No such luck, but the Needle Arrows will be plentiful regardless. It doesn't look like any more local desquitos. Time to head back and then sail. Uh, this way. Yeah, I got that 20 barley. Yeah. It's gonna be really nice. Just getting all that, uh... All that lovely fire res wine early. It's so nice. Okay. Let's go craft a couple of wine. Let's see, needles. The coins go in the other room. This should be, yes. Cultivator away. I don't know why I'm going in here, but that's okay. I can just run over here. Oh yeah, my mouse sensitivity is just fine. In a good spot right now. All right, onward and outward. Uh, not yet. I want to get go back to Comfort Twenty One, and then I can head out. Look at how this is shaping up. 
I love this. I also like the darker item stand color, contrasted with the uh, lighter wood background. Like, this is a nice look with the stone, but I really like that dark wood look. It's not even dark, it's like real dark wood. I just appreciate that, I don't know. Twenty one. What I want. Alright. Let's go. Do some jumping just because my jumps are about to level up. Okay, hopefully the ship is not like being destroyed. No, it's not. Uh let's get rid of some of those. Break this down. Repair. Uh, actually, I didn't want to repair. Hmm. Whoa, that's pretty good. Now, the wave. Come back, wave. Come on. Come on. Come on. No! Ah! <laughs> uh, the storm is good. Storms are good because... The creature that I'm... One of the creatures that I'm looking for has a 5% chance of, of generating or spawning at a spawn point. And uh, a storm means an extra 5% chance. Which is huge. That is double the likeliness of this creature uh, showing up. Hey, okay, let's go forward now. Oh, I don't want to go too much forward. Actually, I wonder if I could turn around this way? That's south. That's probably a little bit more convenient, wind-wise. Maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe I just want to go this way. We'll go wherever the wind decides uh, that it wants me to go. Hopefully the wind changes, because it's currently really, really inconvenient to go out to sea like this. Uh, the waves are also going to, in a storm, like mess with your direction. They're going to push you and pull you and you have to adjust accordingly, which is uh, quite something. Yep, just like that. That's fine. We're not really going anywhere in particular, so that's okay. I'm just trying to find a creature. Give me the creature. Looks like the storm is fading, which is terribly unfortunate. Yeah. That sucks. Eat more soup. Plenty of carrot soup. Back in the ocean. Somewhat unexplored territory, I guess. Although I really want to go north. See if we can't turn around. Even though I'm heading into terrible wind. Not quite going north yet. There we go. This is a little better. Okay, yeah, so I want to go like way up here. This unknown, see if we have that other good elder spot. I already know I have one on the spawn island complex, but if I can explore more of the surrounding area, that would just be really nice. Might as well explore while I sail. Hopefully we can find more leviathans, find the other creature that I'm looking for. All of that good stuff. 
Turn a little bit over this way. Tiny angle difference makes so much of a difference heading over long diff distances. A potentially infinite difference, but we don't have an infinite sized world. Okay, we're already heading somewhat into the unknown, which is really cool. Gotta keep my eye out for leviathans. I still want like two or three more. Maybe uh, four, but I doubt it. Two or three. Probably three. If I can find a triple cluster, that would be it. I would be chillin' with that. This is nice. This is a huge black forest, which is super cool. Presumably the Elder is... Oh yeah, the Elder is still like north. But we got some time. But turn away. The wind shifted, which is great. Oh, gotta keep an eye out. Oh yeah, we got really good wind right now. Again, I don't want to stray too far from the coast here. See, there's a landmass in the distance. Oh yeah. Jack hot. Jackpot, I say jackpot. Oh, and I can see this other island over there. I love that. So we're not too far away on either side. We have this sort of uh, close island. This must be that close island, right? We have a beautiful channel here, there. Mostly here. It means pretty much have guaranteed safe sailing. Okay, let's eat third stamina food. And let's get started. So far, so good. Good RNG. Still good RNG. Let's head over here now. It's begun. said that so ominously. Still have a decent amount of time and I've got a lot of good stamina. Here he goes. The boat's like right there. I can eat or drink a stamina potion if I need to. Okay, fellow sinking. 53! That's a huge haul! That's the difference all those pickaxe levels make. That is incredible. Let's get a move on. We have that land there, which is starting land and then we have this land over here which is the mystery land let's head over to the mystery mystery land considering the wind is right behind us 53 i can't get over 53 that is so good there is odds there they are low odds there are odds that you can mine the leviathan of all of their chitin and it won't even start to sink. It is low odds, but the, the odds are there. Shipwreck. Free fine wood. 
That's legendary. I'll need that fine wood for decorating, so that's huge. Really efficient sorts of fine wood. Also getting dark. That is amazing. And I have the pickaxe too. <laughs> Ram that. Uh let's see. Oh, the chest is just exposed. Give me all of that. Set up a portal. Grab that. Wonder how good this would be. Oh, that's really nice. That's really nice. Not as good as the axe would be, but that's still quality. Is that hidden? It has to be, right? Yes. I knew it. I knew I saw more fine wood poking out somewhere. Do we have another one? Or is that it? I think that might be it. Okay, it's officially nighttime. Let's head back. Amazing Leviathan. So much chitin. Got that shipwreck. So much good. So, so much good. Okay, let's put this on. Ooh, it looks like some of the farm is ready. Some, if not all of it. Grab this regular wood. And we'll put the rest of these valuables in here for now. Let's make another chest. One for the valuables. One for the trophies. Okay, looks like that farm is ready. First I want to craft. I want to use this chitin to make the Abyssal Razor. It's basically an iron tier item that we have access to basically as soon as you can start the game and grab a raft and a pickaxe, which is really, really good. Yeah, it only requires a level 2 workbench, which is so nice. Oh, fine wood instead of regular wood? Hmm. Was it four fine wood? It was, right? Yeah, two leather. Okay. Uh, Grey Dwarf. So even though the Abyssal Razor is only temporarily super excellent, it's still at the moment super excellent. So I will be using it here and there. Grab that. Where is the other source of... Here we go. Leather. Taking much more than I need to. Yeah, should be alright. Alright. Here we go. Ooh, I need 30 chitin and the quality 5 bench to upgrade it. And you see, this is why I haven't uh, processed that last iron. Because I might need to remake the... The... the uh, what is it? The tool shelf. Remake the tool shelf literally just for that. But that's not bad. Put that back in there. Yeah, 22, 22. That is a 44 
uh, 44 damage knife. Yeah, and it's not even maxed out. So that's really good. Look at the stamina cost on that. That is so good. That is so good. And it has no move speed reduction. The knives after this, not very spicy. Not very spicy at all. But uh, at the moment, the Abyssal Razor is incredibly spicy. I'll be using it. I don't have any knife levels though, so it's going to be curious. Let's see. Farming. Yep. Cultivator. It is farm time. Oh, some of these aren't entirely ready. But they will be when I wake up. Okay, so one more Leviathan will do me. And then I'd just be looking for the other creature. Day 77. Oh, this onion generation is going to be really nice. It's going to be so, so nice. Okay, we have 62 turnips and 72 onion seeds. It's planting the onions. That's nine. So I should have eight rows of onions. Whoops, that's 10. So yeah, it should still be eight rows. Here. Uh, excuse me. Stop. That ward is uh, doing weird things. I think the ward is taking the damage instead of the defense, right? Is that how it works? I don't actually know. Huh. I love the way it looks. Oh, it's an Odin. Uh, it is... What is it? What's the word? The Odin themed ward because of the one eye and the beard. Okay, got six more to plant. All right, wonderful. Still want turnips. We got four there. Okay. 
Okay, we got the nine. Thirty one. Thirty. Probably need to expand this farm again, but that's okay. That is a okay. Let's grab ten meat. Uh, boar meat, that is. Make ten turnip stew. Turnip stew goes in here. Put the cultivator away now. Okay, this is a pretty nice setup. Let's get the max 21 minutes and then head back and sail. Not gonna eat yet. There we are. All right, one more Leviathan. That would be, that would be the bomb that to come. I don't know who says that anymore. I don't even say that. First time I've said that. Almost ever. I think I've only said it one time before, and that's weird. Okay, Bodie McBoatface. Oh, and we uh, move. Mm. 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 Man, come on, come on, let's be real. Come on, let's be real now. There we go. Ah, oh, what is this wind? It's not okay. It's it won't be bad going north. Nope. No, I don't want to go in reverse. I don't want to go in reverse. I don't want to go that way going forward though. No. <sighs> Fucking, you know what? I'm gonna push you this way. We're gonna go that way. Okay, I'm I'm in the sea now. Yep. Uh, oh, yeah, it just went right under the thing. Mm-hmm. Oh, oh, decent wind. Come on. Come on, you bastard. Let's go. Yes. Ah. Uh. Sailing, such a fickle art. In this game, at least. Okay, we got some swamps up ahead. Can those be a real swamp? That would be really cool. Also, this starting island, what the hell? There's so much going on. I think before I go on my egg run and, and gather greatness, for decorating my base, I'm going to uh, hop on the, the world viewer. No, 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 the wind, the shitty wind. Uh... <sighs> I'll hop on the world viewer and uh, show you guys the map, do a big map reveal. And then I'll just be going around gathering goods. Decorations for the base. 
That'll be after I kill the Elder, uh, like, five different ways. Hopefully. I don't even have enough Ancient Seeds to kill him two ways right now, but, uh, that could change. Oh. Oh. We have decent win. Yes. Maybe. The question, is this a real swamp? Do we have crypts? Do we have Sterling Geysers? A plenty. I don't know. Eat one of them. Angle a little bit more favorably. Thought I saw an abomination in there. It looks to be a decent size enough where there could be crypts and all of them. Oh yeah, that's a crypt right there. Yep, it's right there. Okay. Hi skeletons, don't mind me. Oh, that's a that's the realest swamp. What, was there skeletons? Yeah, they're right there. That is a real ass swamp. Real swamp. Real swamps with the Sirdling geysers. Oh man, the Sirdling trophies. One of my favorite decorations ever. How far does this starting island go? This is rivaling some of the largest that I've ever seen. Even on the world viewer. Like, this is huge. Like, this is all the same shit. In fact, this close island is not even an island. It's probably connected to the starting island complex. Look at all the crypts in here. Hello. Oh, the wind. No, stop. Stop doing that wind. This is nuts. And I am a certified squirrel. Because I'm loving this. It's not live then, is it? Is that? Is that a Leviathan? Let's find out! Fucking like... Eh. This thing? Hard to see. That thing? Don't know. Maybe? Kinda looks like one. It could just be a land mass. I don't know. I'm trying to find out. We could get one of those other creatures, that would be cool. Let's see, this seems to be another channel, which is great. Get back to good wind. Let's see, I haven't been over there. Not really. I swear, if that's a Leviathan and I spotted it from all the way over there, I'm gonna be so happy. That's some decent wind. I think it is. I think I was correct. That's absurd. What a great call out. Well, there's my last Leviathan. I'm pretty sure. Unless that's a microbiome. 
could be a microbiome. Which would be really disappointing. These waves are messing with my... Waves are messing with my, my turning. My direction. That's a microbiome. Oh, that's disappointing. That's just a tiny island. It's probably planes of that. Yep. Very disappointing. Oh, great. Fog in the planes. My favorite. I'm saying no to that. Nope. No, thank you. Nope. Turning right the fuck around. No, nope, you're not gonna you're not gonna trick me, planes fog sailing. The worst part of this game. Nope. Not doing it. I'm not being fooled like that. It's an easy way to lose all your things out in the middle of nowhere. Turning this way as the wind has changed. Pretty sure it's Black Forest dead ahead. So we're pretty safe. Yep. Get the, get the fog out of here. Wow. What I just got like siren baited into into that plains fog. What a nightmare. Yeah, there's planes over there. What a nightmare that could have been. Like, holy shit. I got jabated. Whew. Brutal. Let's head back to this area. Cross over this direction. I don't just want to head through the same waters that I've uh, already been through, exactly, if I can help it. My eyes out for leviathans and the like. I guess le leviathans are more lumpy and a little less flat than a microbiome island. Microbiome is not an official term, by the way. I'm just saying it. I got plenty of turnip stew. I'll eat another muck shake though. Looks like it's this island sort of connecting all the way over here. Gonna need to turn a little bit to avoid that outcrop there. Please don't tell me this is all connected. That would I would lose my mind. That's the real swamp over here, maybe? Looks like it. And then this is something else? Question mark? Black forest with some swamp. More microbiome. Swamp. <laughs> the Draugr just spawning in. They just look like they stand up, like, really fast. Like those military clips of dudes in the army just messing around and Superior walks in and they just gotta stand up immediately. Okay, we got Swamp in here. Just gonna go straight beyond this microbiome and then I'm gonna bank uh bank left. We have more black forest and swamp. I can start banking. 
get some better wind behind these sails. And we can maybe head over here. Check back to the borders of the previous island. Oh, the wind is changing. Okay, the wind wants me to go over here now, which I can do. Totally fine with this because of Mr. Portal in my inventory. It looks like there's more black forest up here, which is cool. I'd like to get out of the swamp. These nasty swamp areas clouding my vision. More microbiomes. Looks like meadows up there. Head over. Yeah, it's meadows. Go beyond the meadows a little bit. Hopefully we don't get too much swamp air. Don't want a beach up there. More meadows. Ooh, and you can see that rock. Still not seeing Leviathan. Yeah, it seems like I'm going around this entirely new island now. That's okay. Bunch of meadows. Go over here just to thread the needle. Oh, it's nighttime. Night sailing is the no go. Let's dock. Luckily, Meadows is super safe. Excellent. No such luck for leviathans or otherwise, but that's okay. Got some farming done. Leviathan. Found... Oh, I found one today, which is really good already. Go sleeping and... See if I can't bring the boat back over to the starting island. Oh, these are done. That's super nice. Nice and swift. Seventy eight. Head on back. See if that wind is good, and then I'll cut uh, right back over to that starting island. Not bad. In fact, this is really good. 
is really good because I want to get over there. Ah, come on, carve. Full speed ahead. We're kind of still going a little north, which I'm not a fan of. This is much better. Head back over this way. Even if we have to go through open ocean a little bit, that's okay. I have the tools to go through open ocean. Little bit of uncharted territory here until we can get back over to this closer island. There's that swamp microbiome over to the left. Maybe we can find a leviathan in these seas. Hit that last leviathan, that would be amazing. just gonna be a last uh, short last excursion what is that what is that rock over there I think I'm getting debated again I think that's too lumpy this time to be Leviathan although I could be wrong what is that Gone from view, whatever it was. Whatever, it's it best not to chase after things in the distance. I think Leviathans generate pretty close. Not generate, but like... Pop up. I forget the... It might be generate. I forget the, uh, the word for that. Render, not generate. Beautiful lighting. Can't give uh, the devs enough credit for the lighting and the art direction. Yes, we are approaching. We are approaching the lands. I love it. Looks like another channel up here. We have this island up here, and we have this stuff. So this is the close island here, and then it could be connected to this, which is ultimately also connected to the starting island. I want to head through this channel, because this seems to be this, which is all interior, which is really cool. If this is really just like a huge uh, gulf or some shit, I want to explore it. That's sick. Get rid of that, because I think this is all starting island complex. And that this is just a giant gulf. If I find another shipwreck, I want it. Why well, I love sailing near the Black Forest. Also, these gulfs are really cool. If they're wide enough, you get a little bit of ocean, and if there's a little bit of ocean nearby, then we could potentially find creatures that we're looking for. I love this black forest on both sides. Really, really nice. I think this is a good angle right now. Seems like Elder is just right there. Let's get rid of this as a swim point. Considering now we have sailing. 
No need for swim points. There's a nest over there. There's a nest over there. A bunch of nests. Oh yeah, I think this is just a massive gulf. I'm so happy. We got good wind going through the gulf. It's definitely ocean in here now that it's opening up. Which I'm super psyched about. I think there's a minimum width before there can be ocean. But there's definitely ocean in here. Look at this. This is so cool. Ah, so this is probably something that takes you through there, I'm guessing. A little bit of a, a watery crossroads. So that you can get out, maybe? I don't know. I'll have to come back to it, though. Because right now the wind is too good for me not to keep on going this way. I want to avoid that tiny meadows island if I can. This is nice. Whenever things just right, sailing is so peaceful. Of course, it's rare that everything's just right. But, it really, it's really, really nice when it's all, when it's all right. Yeah, this is all connected, I think. Maybe. Makes the starting island absolutely gargantuan. That's okay. Probably a really nice view from up there. This house down here. Yeah. It's beautiful. Village! This dock. I want to check for one thing. And that would be... Is there a maypole in here? No. I will pick up the raspberries just for like muck shakes. Just to have. Knives one. It begins. It begins. Yeah, I have so many bow levels I can afford to not... Uh, kill these guys with the bow. Knives two. Ooh, knives 3. 218. Yeah, that's a knife middle mouse there. Especially nice going downhill like so. <laughs> it's just... Uh, I love it. Can't get enough of it. Are you a 2 star? You're definitely a star. Okay, 1 star. Oh, the spacing was just off. There we go. Yeah, knives. Woo! Knives do very well because that middle mouse in like super linear areas. Uh, you know, except for, uh, <clears throat> you know, considering the at gear also does extraordinarily well in linear areas. The knives are, you know, they're, they're like a little outclassed here and there, but uh, can't beat the Abyssal Razor DPS when you get it. Oh, 
you can't escape me, dear. And escape me. Let's check the chests inside. There's probably some goodies, some arrows. Others, yeah, certainly. Set up a portal in here. Grab up all these nice resources. Portal home, and then I'll end the episode. Looks like nothing there. I feel like I've yet to maybe experience the true majesty of knives, although I'm not, you know, uh, I'm not, uh, not putting too much credence, not putting too much respect on their name at all because I've seen what other weapons can do. And the other weapons don't really need the uh, stealth sneak or a DPS aspect. The control and the effective damage is good enough to just dominate everything. Unlucky with the chests. Although I could be wrong. It seems like knives are a, uh, they're a helper strat. And uh, also a builder non-combatant strat. You know, with the stealth and normally the less material costs. Of course, the Abyssal Razor ex is extremely good in passing, considering how early you can get it. It's good, and then it gets outclassed. It's like, monstrously good. And then gets outclassed. But it's monstrously good for a long time. Well, if you get it in the meadows. And you can get lucky and have Leviathan generate uh, just nearby your spawn. In the, like, right off the coast of the meadows. You can go grab it with a raft, antler pickaxe. Grab yourself a nice abyssal razor early, even at quality one, it's absurd. Feathers in here. Yeah, that being said, I hope you've enjoyed, hope you learned something, hope you're entertained. And I will see you guys some other time. Bye!